Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Look, yeah, I've been shopping. First in the morning, I knew I had to get a couple little things, but you know when I hit the mall, sometimes I go a little mad with power. Well, what can I say? There's a couple of things, a couple of places. Oh, please, I went to a couple of stores. I went crazy, but not that bad maybe anyway let me get started this morning i know i had to go to walmart because um i wanted to see believe it or not that's where i get the lighters i know someone said i think candle nerd had mentioned to go to walmart to get good lighters and i did need another backup of my multi-purpose well this is not a you know those candle lighters there it is you can see it big i got this one this was cute I don't know what it's like. I've never purchased this thing before, but I love the handle. Look how pretty it is. It's like a kitty. Yeah, so I'm going to try this. That plus I needed cat food for my cat, and that's where I get the prices, you know, pretty good from uh, the Walmart. The place was packed, people. Packed, packed. And I think what's happening lately is that we've been getting so much snow that um, people are preparing themselves on the weekend that they have to pack, you know, like stock up on items and Walmart is a good place to get your items from. Also, that's one reason. Second reason, the parking lot was unbelievable and I know that for anyone that's living in the snow covered states that freaking cotton picking so tired of snow it's unbelievable but for people who have of course experienced snow a lot of snow hate the snow tired of the snow sorry ranting <laughs> they have now these snow mountains that they accumulate that the plows push over into the parking lots they have no other space to put the accumulation of snow so they take up a lot of spots in the parking lot and that's what happened in Walmart. Um, funny thing though, as I'm heading towards Walmart trying to find a spot to park, a parking area, I see a car in front of me and I see a little, the back of the trunk and it says B and little wings and I'm looking at it and I'm thinking, I've seen that somewhere before. Wait, no, it can't be. But yeah, yeah, it was. Park the car, walk over to Walmart, and there it is, lo and behold, a Bentley. Yes, people, a Bentley parked in front of Walmart. And I thought, gee, you have a Bentley, which is an extremely expensive car. How, why, I don't understand. But then I started to think, well, you know, everybody has to save a buck here and there, and maybe that's what they're doing. They got the beautiful Bentley, and why not? So, can I say a Bentley by Walmart? Oh, wow. Anyway, I continued on to my regular mall and I wanted to get a couple of things. Now, the thought was here. I was only going to go to Bath and Body Works because I was running low on my foaming hand soaps. The foaming hand soaps have not been on a great deal of a special nothing at all, but they had them for $4 and I figured, okay, I got my coupons. Why not? This coupon, though, I had was very good. What did I get? Here we are with Wild Mango Mojito. And this one is sparkling mango, fresh papaya, and citrus. The cut so pretty. Wild Mango Mojito. No, smells good. And the next one, this one I was interested in, was Copacabana Coconut. There it is. And this one has creamy coconut, fresh palm, and vanilla. It smells good, though. Yeah, I have to stop. Stop for a second. It just smells good. It's, a, it's just such a pretty fragrance. So I got this one. And finally, because I wanted to spend $10. Oops. Things are falling apart, falling down. It's like bowling pins. Everything fell over. Okay, Rio Sunset. No, Rio Samba Sunset. There. Pretty. And this one has wild and a white amber, orange flower, and musk. It smells beautiful. So there it is. Now, the reasoning. First, I needed foaming bath soaps, but it wasn't only that. I knew I had one coupon left, and this was a special coupon, and I had shown it to you during my other hauls. Um, the coupon I had was a round coupon, and it was for a thousand wishes, and I had mentioned to you that this one was especially good because it was good from November 2nd, 2014 till February 15th, 2015. 
And if you spent $10, you got any Thousand Wishes product up to $14 for free. So today I spent these, the three of these were $12 and I got this $14 item, which is a Thousand Wishes fragrance mist for free. And it does smell nice, so I got this one and I figured I might as well use it up because February 15th, why not? Why not? And when the hell does yeah, this place ever give us coupons that last that long? It was a miracle, I tell you, a miracle. Anyway, as I was paying for my items, something terrible happened. No, it wasn't terrible. It was probably not good for me. But I walked through the store. I got my, my only focus was this. I did go look at the candles again, hoping that I would get something from them. I thought that there were candle price. They're all right. Now, you know the foaming soaps were $4. The candle prices, uh, normally they're $22.50. We're always thinking they're going to come to the to buy two for 22. No, they're not buy two for 22. They were buy two for 24. And Susan D, I think, mentioned this. Hi, Susan. Yeah, please. Their prices, their coupons, their, their nothing is, the prices are not as good as they used to be. But we've been getting spoiled. It happens. But two for 24. I got a funny feeling you're right, Susan. I think they're going to start inching the things up little by little and think we won't notice. But we noticed. Anyway, there were two for 24. Looked at the three wick 14 and a half ounce candles and thought, ah, the smells are all right. Nothing out of this world. But I had noticed before I had gone to the store, I looked at their website and I had noticed that they did come out with a couple of new fragrances. Now this time I did not go to the girls and I know that some of the sales girls are so nice to salespeople. Um, and sometimes when I ask them, sometimes they'll pull things from the back, sometimes not depending on who you go to. But as I'm out going to pay for my items, one of the sales assistants started pulling candles from the back for another customer. And I happened to look at the candles and I looked and lo and behold, they were the candles that I saw on the website that were not on display in the store. And I was looking at them and I knew the girl at the register and I looked at the candles and I looked at her and I said, you know, to the customer, first I said, are those two for 24 brand? You know, the ones that are on their website offered for two for 24. The girl says to me explicitly, yeah, they're two for 24. That's what they are on the website. But I've seen that happen and I've gone to the um, salespeople and sometimes they say to me, well, we can't do it. But apparently they could do it. It was on the website, two for 24. They had them in the store. They let us buy them. If they pulled them from the back, two for 24. So my sales assistant actually said to me, if you want them two for 24, I'll give them to you for two for 24. <sighs> Gosh, why did I look to the side? I didn't need any more candles, but they, I had to. Anyway, here are some of the new scents. There it is. I don't know what the heck they call this collection. I'm sure many of you do. Here's one of them though, fresh. And this is in the scent Spring Blue Skies. Actually, it just says fresh and on the bottom it says Spring Blue Skies. And I will read you the scent description. The scent description, enjoy a fragrance inspired by throwing open the windows on a perfect spring day with a blend of breezy air notes, blue water, and a hint of citrus. Three wick, 14 and a half, blue color. Smell? like fresh air really pretty and and water it says blue water it smells like fresh air and blue water i don't know if it's blue it just smells like water sea water i don't know it smelled good liked it and i have to show you the lid here now this lid i thought it was going to be the intrigue and opulence lid no it's not because i happen to have smoke berries and incense in front of me and there it is and this lid also lovely, but it's not like this lid. It's just a little bit different. See how pretty? Pretty lids. Anyway, beautiful lids on these new candles. Another one that I got is the scent Love. And I hope you can see it, Love. And this one on the bottom says Hearts and Flowers, and it's red. Three wick, 14 and a half can ounce candle. Smell, it's fruity more than that one. I like the blue one a lot. This one reads, um, 
Add a lovely touch to the decor with any, to, of any room with the fragrance of pink peonies, sparkling orange, and sweet blueberries. I don't smell blueberries. I definitely do smell the citrus. It's mentioned the sparkling orange. I smell sparkling orange. And peonies, I don't smell yet. Maybe when it burns, I will smell it. I know the fragrance of peonies. Beautiful flowers. One of my favorite uh, flowers. Magnificent. But it does have a strong scent to it. But I don't know if this one is going to have peonies. There it is. This is love. So pretty, pretty. But the other fragrances that were available that I did get to smell. Sunshine, which was yellow in color. Uh, verbena Blossom. It smelled like lemons. It was very nice. I almost got it. Almost. But I behaved. Um, they had also Smile, which was pink. And it says pink lemonade on it, but it smells like Hawaiian punch. I don't know. Happy, which was green. And it's and it says on the bottom, sunshine and green um, daisies. It smells like sweet flowers and meadows. Does that make any sense? But that's what it smelled like. They also have on the website um, something called Love and Sunshine, which is going to be one of their new fragrances. No, I didn't ask for the candle. Maybe I should have, but... I had to stop. I already got two candles that I didn't need. I hope they smell good though. Anyway, I continued on in my mall and I walked past the Yankee Candle Store. Now, I have two malls that I normally go to. One has a regular Yankee Candle Store and the other one has an authorized dealer Yankee Candle Store, which is where I got this from. Um, the authorized dealer candy or Yankee Candle Store is where I had last told you that I had seen the Girl Scout cookies before they were even in my store. In that authorized dealer store, that's where I saw these. So I'm walking past and I see candles that I thought, hey, wait a second. You know, you walk and suddenly you're not, you don't want to look, but you're walking, walking, and then you stop and you go, wait a minute. Well, what did they have there that was alluring? That was calling my name? It wasn't really, but you know. They had the Easter candles there. Yes, they did, people. They had their Easter candles already. And suddenly, because the little store, it's a small store, it actually said, be back at 3 o'clock. And, and um, I did take pictures of the front of the store. But I thought, let me call my Yankee Candle person, the people that I know at my store, to see why is it that they have these. Does my store have them? But I called the store and they said, no, they don't have them, not for another two weeks. So the authorized dealer had them before they did. And what's even better, in that store they had buy one large jar, get one free. Yes, people, buy one large one, get one free. I was going to go... I mean, since it was be back at three, I went to Bath and Body Works, then I went back to Yankee Candle, and I looked at stuff that you know won't come out till Easter, and you know what this is, Yankee Candle's Peeps, people, Peeps, Marshmallow Chicks, is that what they call this thing? Yeah, Peeps, Marshmallow Chicks. I smelt the large jar. I'm not, and I'm going to tell you the truth, I'm not a marshmallow, sweet kind of fragrance kind of person. I do like, you know, or caramel. I don't like sweet, sweet, sweet fragrances. I had to smell it. I wanted to see what all the hubbub was about, why people love this so much. Smelt a large jar, and instead of getting a large jar, yes, I know it's buy one, get one free, but I figured I'm going to give the tart a... I'll burn it. I'll warm it. So I, I got this in a tart and it was jelly beans was there. I know people wanted to find out. It smells just like jelly beans. It's very, very, very sweet. Cotton candy was there. Smelt it also sweet. Um, not that that's a bad thing. That's just me. I know a lot of people like the sweet fragrances. Something that may be new, I think, salt water taffy. Brand new, I think. Um, it was there and again I got this in a tart they're all sweet all of them and something brand new that I've never seen white chocolate apple I believe it to be new and this one here there you go yes I got it in a tart form and it smells like this one taffy smells like sweet taffy mm -hmm. and white chocolate apple smells like chocolate covered apples 
but it's sweet too. I don't know if I'm going to like it. So this is why I got the tarts. I figured I will warm them up um, tonight actually, because if any of these, and I'm most interested in probably this one, the apple one, if any of these are, they smell good, I may go back to the store and buy one large jar, get one free, one large jar free. And this store has them before my Yankee Candle store has them. The regular store has them. So we're going to find out about them. I'll, I'll find out. I'm going to, I think I'll probably, yeah, I'm warming them up tonight. Oh, well, what can I say? I went after I walked out of the mall, not seeing anything else. Oh gosh, it's hard but I was behaving. I went to uh, Target, Target and I got some more of these things. The, um, what do they call them? Unscented tea lights because I'm really liking. I've been using them in the Colonial Candle Wax Warmer that I showed you and that little son of a gun, I'm telling you, I don't know if any of you took advantage and got it. I showed it to you, the little ginger jar thing. Um, it was $5. I got it half price to, or I think it was I got it at a good sale. Anyway, of course you use these tea lights. These only last about four hours, but for me it's enough and it warms them so quickly and so nicely. And this was $6.49. I know. I don't know. A hundred tea lights for $6.49. I think that's a good price. And I like that they come in a box because the last time I bought these, it came in this case that everything fell out. But this is nice. It comes in like a little box with a little top. You can take it off. See? And what else did I get? Something for tonight. I wanted to see this movie. Oh my gosh, do I like this man. John Wick. I didn't see it in the movies when it was out this year. I didn't see it. I got the DVD, Blu-ray, DVD, and digital HD version. And this was in um, Target. Target. And this was for $19.99. I know they had the regular DVD, which was, I think, $14.99. But... I love deleted scenes and usually for some reason, I think it's terrible, but the deleted scenes are usually on the Blu-ray one and I'm going to see him tonight. He is so cute. Keanu Reeves. Oh my gosh, he's cute. Now I sound like an 18 year old. I'm sorry, people. I like Keanu Reeves. I think he's a fine looking man. Okay. I'll behave. Um, but I'll see this later. And this one does have deleted scenes and I'll check it out. And I like too that you can... You have the digital HD and you can see it on your PC, so computer and there it is. So that's what I got. There's where I was. And as I said, um, went to Walmart, saw the Bentley pulling in, waiting. I don't know what they were buying in Walmart. But as I was leaving this mall or the mall with the this stuff in it, I saw another expensive car, a Maserati. Yes, people. It was parked in the parking lot. I'm thinking new car plates. I'm thinking, oh my gosh, what's going on here? <sighs> Everyone has to shop. Anyway, that is it. Oh, there was one more thing. Not that you need to see this, but yeah, I got a heating pad, people. Why did I get a heating pad? You know, you know, as you shovel the snow or you clean the snow and you clean off your car and it's cold outside and you clean off your car and you shovel the snow and it's cold outside. Sorry, people, but my body hurts, so I got this. You know, I got this at a better price, too. Again, Target. Had them on special. Love it. Not that you needed to see it, but anyway, that was my shopping haul. Anyway, thank you for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe, and take care and keep warm. It's supposed to snow yet again. <sighs> Done with it, but it happens. Anyway, thank you for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe, and take care. And I'll let you know about these little, these new things. And Marshmallow Peeps, see if you can find an authorized dealer. And I'll let you know about these new candles, too. Take care. Bye-bye.